Hi guys, it's Melissa. How's everybody doing today? Welcome to the channel. It is May 1st, which means planner flip throughs and change. Hold on one second. I have got to try and get this camera adjusted correctly. Okay, I think that will keep everything centered. Okay, so as you guys know, I've been getting a lot of new planners lately, and I've been trying to decide what to use and how. Um, so this is a um, mitch match of what I've used this past month, some on and off. Um, I probably, I'm not going to commit to using anything the rest of the month till I get, I've got a few more new ones coming in. I've got an Erin Condren coming in, actually two. Um, I also have a vendor spec coming in, but I'm thinking I probably will not get that till next month. And then I have one more Aurora Estelle planner coming in and I think that's it. I bought so many this, this month because I just been buying like crazy on Macari. I got, uh, one, two new Kiki K planners. Um, of course, this one that I got showed you yesterday. This is a Chapters. I got a new um, Aurora Estelle. A new May Design um, Traveler's Notebook. And just bukus and bukus of, of Webster's Pages. So basically, guys, I don't even know how many I have anymore. <laughs> I got my new Happy Planner that I was wanting from the new uh, spring release. Um, let's see. So yeah. As far as box planners go, or ring planners go, I now have 1, 2, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, I think 17 Carpe Diems. Most of those are A5s. I have six Webster's Pages, um, A5s, two A5 Agenda 52s, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine Kiki Ks. Three of those are, um, personal and others are A5s. And then I have my traveler's notebooks that I loved. I, um, um, 1407. I have two of those in B6. And then I have one of the tool um, traveler's notebooks. The small one. That's my personal. Kitty Cat's going to make an appearance. And then I have all my happy planners, which I don't know. I've lost count of those. Those are, I have them everywhere. They're just everywhere. <laughs> and like I said, the vast majority of these I will never use. And I, I readily admit that. It's a collection. Like some people collect stamps. Some people collect butterflies. I'm collecting planners. That's my thing. Come on. Come on, Arabella. Come on, baby girl. Okay, come on, Arabella, before you knock everything over. Come on. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> you can't see that, or can you? Yeah. Okay, come on. Come on. Your hair is flying everywhere. Oh my gosh, it is shedding time for the animals. Okay, all right, okay. Uh. Holy moly. She's just a purring. Ow! Now she's a scratching because she loves to crawl. Go ahead, jump. Can you jump? She loves to climb up on my back and sit on my shoulders. I don't know why, but she loves that. Oh gosh. All right. So, let's get somewhat started. I'm hoping I can get through this without too many interruptions trying trying oh look at there she got all over me she sits up in my window and so this morning i caught her digging look at that digging in my little succulent that i had sitting up there getting some sun yeah she did that she did that bad kitty this is going to be a long video because i'm having to clean up after her before i can get started okay all right, so let's start with the one I got yesterday. I'm going to beat her. I finally found the link to this. Um, I'll try and repost it again in the uh, description if you want it. I did send it to one of the uh, um, viewers that was asking about it because when I was trying to pull it up, 
it was not coming up for me. It was just weird and she had the same problem. So I uh, went in and I was able to finally get it and I posted it for her. So I will try and repost it for you guys if you want to check this out. I found my invoice. I looked in it and these uh, sell for this particular one is called one of their business planners and it's it is a personal size but it's a personal wide which means it's a little bit shorter than the regular personal size and but wider which is kind of good because you actually get more writing space um and it re it's regular 65 dollars and they've got it on sale right now for 40 but i looked at my invoice and i only paid 20 for mine so i am thinking i must have had some kind of uh coupon or a code or something and i was able to slap in there so basically i got a 65 dollar planner for 20 dollars not bad and my favorite color ever 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 is lilac i'm sorry you cannot get prettier than this color not to mention it's a very it's just a very clean looking planner. Now this one, well, I played with it a lot last night and I am going to use it as my personal planner um, this coming month. I'm not sure how much I will use it, but I will use it um, because once, if I, and honestly, once the uh, Vanderspat comes, that's going to be my baby. That's going to be my, my, my go-to planner because I just love the vendor specs um but like i said that will probably not be here till next month those take they ship from the netherlands they're handmade custom made and so it takes some time so anyway until then i've got this beauty to play with and then she will she will probably use some but she will also go into my collection but so just removing, I did this last night because like I said, I was wanting to see exactly what I could do with it. I haven't got her fletched yet enough where she lays, you know, lays down. But this is what I did from last month. I removed uh, the stuff and you'll see where I didn't use it quite as much as I have in the past because I've been using some of my other ones. But that was all I did with my monthly I went in and I did, which I'm doing this in a lot of my planners now because, you know, with the COVID and everything, I've decided, I've started using them as scripture writing. Um, I just write scriptures in some of the days as well as just kind of diary what I did. Uh, see, this is just going through. This has got several scriptures in it, bunches. Um, I do write out my reminders and just you know and a lot of it i just decorate for the heck of decorating i mean let's face it this is kind of a hobby it's fun um since i'm not working i don't schedule that much but i do have to keep track of doctor's appointments for me and my husband and errands i need to run for not only my household but my in-laws right now during the covid thing because i, I we don't want them going out in it so i take care of their stuff so every little thing from shopping list to um you know, see, and that's pretty. I love how I did that with some of my Simply Gilded and then didn't have a blasted thing to write down. I could go back in and write down what I did those past few days, but I've already done that in some of my other planners. But, so that did not get used a lot. I'm going to, for me, you know, I, I, I do have some that I use specifically for, of course, I've got my medical planner, which is my the one I use the most. That is the one I'm most faithful with because that's where I put all of my medical stuff from notes to everything. Um, all our information that we need from my husband and I both. Um, so it is the only one that I am religious about keeping it the way it is. Uh, the rest of them... I just enjoy their fun. I love changing in and out of new planners and, and setting them up. The whole process is just, it's relaxing and it's fun. And that's, you know, it's a hobby. It is a hobby. So this is some of the stuff that it came with. It came with the little cards like this. A lot of these little cards. This one says, it all starts by making small changes in the right direction. I tell people that all the time about things. Just start. Get on that journey. Make one good choice at a time. 
and that's that's how you you change your entire life this is some of the little um inserts that i got from carpe diem this says trust in the lord with all your heart and lean not on thine own understanding proverbs 3 5 this one is one of the two um dividers that actually came with this planner now what this planner came with let me get to it are these so it's a daily that's why they call it a business planner it just basically has daily inserts for you to go in and write out what you need to be doing for each day it had no monthly inserts um just these dailies which uh i told you guys earlier yesterday that excellent excellent quality paper thrilled with the quality of paper so this is some of the stuff that i put in it this again is from uh carpe diem's uh faith planner thing so you get where you get to write down your reading loving learning listening hoping changing enjoying remembering your gratitude what you're praying about or or you know even a prayer list so you get several of those and then you have these cute little um note papers how cute are those i love those and then this i made last night i finally broke down and bought me a giant pack of vellum and so i'm printing things on vellum and i love it i did this this is a pink blush shaded one and so i printed this little unicorn face on it more of this more of that and then here is your these inserts the monthly ones that i'm using are from agenda 52 and so you get, you know, your notes, holidays, special occasions, birthdays. And then here is the monthly view, which I just, like I said, I just got started. So it's not really decorated at all. Just got a few things on there. And then so from, I won't use that from there. I'll start using this, which is May 1st, today, right there. And then I just put some of my little LOL flip, flippy thingies in there to keep track, separate the sections and i've only got a couple of months in here right now because the rings in this are very small and i was as i was looking on the uh, website i didn't see options for larger rings if you want larger rings you have to go with one of their larger planners so but so i'm going to try and use this with the bare bones girls <laughs> so we shall see we shall see how that works but anyway, she's beautiful. The quality is gorgeous. I mean, you would not know that it's um, my, I got a couple of my Kiki K's. Well, this one's sitting right beside me that is in the same kind of leather. The, the, this is in the Kiki K is real leather as to where this chapter's planner is not. And if you can get a good look there, you will see. And I mean, the, the touch and the feel of it's the same. So it's not real leather it is simulated leather but man does it feel like the real thing it's beautiful i love it okay so we'll put that back there and then the next one we will be flipping through will be this one this is my a5 kiki k now i've been grappling with do i want to uh, use this one for the i think i will use this one till till june and then i will switch out to one of my other ones because i've got the two new Kiki K's that I have a, a lavender Kiki K that I bought last year. I, and then the two new ones that I bought recently, one is the beautiful ice blue and another one is a uh, really bright yellow. So either one of those would be nice for, for summer. And so it, I'm thinking of using either one of those or uh, one of my Webster's pages. Cause I've got one that I really do like that I got. It's the gray floral and it's got a beautiful texture to it it feels like real leather itself so i really like it so anyway but i think i'm just going to stick with this one for now for the rest of this month anyway got all my little pretties already in there and stuff um so i go to my monthly and i what i have let's see how far am I into it? Today's a new day. That is for December 2020. That was... Okay, so March. And there's April. And what I've been doing with this is this. I've not been going crazy with decorations on my monthlies in this. I've just been basically going in and actually writing down what I need to do. And then I've not been removing them. I've just left them in there. And so, of course, 
we're in May now, so this one is no longer needed. Um, there's my May calendar. Did a little bit of decorating, not a ton. I'll basically write down appointments and bills um, on the 8th of this month. I will be a new grandma because our my stepdaughter, Kylie, she is being induced with her first baby. And we've been praying a lot for her and her husband. He works in a... Um, a residential home where he takes care of disabled people uh senior citizens and things like that which of course right now during this time has been very scary at one point he did get sick and they thought that he might have it and they tested him he was negative he just had a, an actual cold and then kylie being pregnant we've been worried about her she works for um here in our state the department of social services in the child protective services department so um, she's been out there in the middle of all this too. So oh, it's been kind of stressful like it has been for everybody. So we've just been praying a lot for her and for our new baby. Who's, her name will be Kaya. She's, her name is already Kaya. So we can't wait for that. And then this, I have the monthly separated in by itself. And then we go to the weekly and so this has been, I have written more in this one. I didn't write so much in that one, but starting here on the 13th, 15th, I really started writing a lot more down stuff. I had to remind myself of, keep track of. Um, so this is where I've been putting a lot of that stuff in. Just pop it out and write it down and pop it back. And so that was yesterday. Here we are today. We start with the first. So I will remove those. And then I do have through the six through Wednesday decorated. And I will have to finish that out. So I'll probably do that sometime today. Um, just more of my little things that I do. Made my first car payment on my new car today. Ouch. That was an ouch. <laughs> Okay, so there goes the Kiki K. And then for Happy Planner, here is my mini, which this is my favorite, favorite color, favorite cover of all time. If they, the only way I will ever change this cover out is if they actually come out with something prettier, which is going to be hard for them to do because <laughs> this is gorgeous. Um, haven't been quite pulling them out as much either. Let's see, what did I get through? So here's April. I used most of my, these are all the, from the Homebody collection. And this, the, the actual planner itself is Homebody. So that's what I've been using. I have some daily sheets in here from the Glam Girl. Um, just cute little things that I put in here. This is a pretty little card that I like to keep from Miss Cherie. Love her. And then just little things that I have made. But yeah, I just, because all this is, is a happy notes. And so I just took out my homebody um, inserts and I'm using it in that. I put in some rose gold disc to make it big enough to hold all my stuff. So this is for, this is the dashboard layout. So that's the top I've been using it. I have been writing in it a good bit too. I have my prayer list there. Um, I've been decorating a lot with the home body because I love those colors. This actually came out of, of the new gardening collection. Oh, the flower book is so pretty. So, so pretty. Trust Jesus every moment of every day, ladies. Every moment of every day. And then this will go into May 1st. So this is where we're at right now. So I will go in and decorate some of this because I haven't done very much at all. Just a little here and there. So there is my happy planner. I will pull out those pages. And then also this is the first time I've ever used one of these. And this one is, is very much customized. Um, <coughs> excuse me I had bought when I went when all of this came out before the COVID thing shut everything down I went into a Michaels and they had nothing left <laughs> this is from let me show you I Franken planned the heck out of this one so 
I got one of the um, wrong wrong planners. This is the oh, it was the last one they had. I'm not a huge wrong wrong fan. This one's pretty, but anyways, what I did is I ordered this one off their website, which I love because I love the the uh, Squad Go Girls. They're my favorite. They're so pretty. The flowers they use, the colors they use, and it goes through December. So I am going to use it through December and then um, probably will start, you know, that's why I put these in here. So this will take me all the way through June of next year um, when they do come out in January or they usually come out what November, December with their uh, 2021 launch that's just for the one year the 12 month if they have something cuter which uh, i'm sure they will i'll probably get one and discard all of this anyway so i'm thinking i'm going to do but in the meantime there is april so now these don't come with a month month thing they just come with this this is your monthly these are some things that um i actually made from some stuff that i've been using um see these i bought most of these i bought off etsy and then i just combined them use my canva to combine them and, and make them in the proper um thing i need my my words left so that's where things kept getting canceled doctor's appointments but i did go in and i wrote a lot in these again bible verses just notes kind of diarying out things um <coughs> excuse me I'm sitting here in front of an open window with allergies. That's not a good thing. Um, so this is this is my favorite little flip through for my happy planners. I love that thing. It's so pretty. So I did quite a bit of decorating. I haven't written anything since then because I I got the Aurora Estelle and I gotta admit I just been planted in that one past few days, even though. I haven't got it set up till start till this month so but anyway i will go back through and fill out a lot of the stuff uh because i do like to keep track you know of things that i did and when i did them and things that i ordered when i order them because sometimes girls i have things show up at my post office and it's like oh oh i forgot about that one yeah that's me <laughs> <laughs> the brains just slowly leak out of your ears the older you get that's like that's your birthday present every year as you get older happy birthday there goes more brain cells leaking out your ears all right and this is my big big girl i could not find this one in store they were sold out they were also sold out online and I finally found a seller on Macari that had one and I got it. So I was like, yes, thank you so much. So what I have done, I have my big expander disc on this one because I use this for a lot of stuff. Look at the interior of that. Is that not the prettiest? Again, it's my squad goals. I told you I love them. Um, this came with, the actual planner came with orange disc, this color. I've never seen, really seen that with Happy Planner. Um, I'm not a huge orange girl, so I'm thinking about actually selling those. I might just sell those discs. I normally keep all my discs for different things, but I might sell it. So I use my Todays for just jotting down almost diary stuff in this one. So I have a lot of that. I have things that I've never used, like my social networking. I have been trying to... <sighs> My brain is just not organized enough to actually organize that stuff to put it down on paper. I'm not going to lie. So I'm working on that. I have utterly failed at my habit tracking. <laughs> totally failed. This came out of the teacher uh, planner packet because it. this is for like role taking, you know, classrooms and things. And I'm like, this makes a perfect habit tracker. This is almost exactly how my habit tracker and my Aaron Condor and Olgo Folio is set up. Almost exactly so those really work and then i just have stuff and stuff and stuff and stuff and here is april there is my month i did not jot down i jot down some stuff but not a ton i do like to go back in and fill it out it passes the time and it like i said it lets you keep up with things so <laughs> yeah this is what i wrote for this date 
stir crazy, stir crazy, stir crazy, stir crazy, stir crazy, stir crazy, stir crazy. That's me. That's all of us right now, I know. And here is the Easter one. And that really didn't pan out very much for anyone, did it? But you know what? It's celebrating the Lord's resurrection. So as long as you get up and you recognize what Christ did for us, that's what it's about. It's Resurrection Sunday. You know, the the bunnies and the Easter eggs and chocolate stuff with and getting together with the family and the kids is fun. But it's about the Lord is what it's about. So this was the week of the 13th. I used a lot of the stickers from the, um, this is from the gardening one that has all the flowers. They're just really, 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 really pretty. This one is also, I think, from it too. Maybe not the whole thing. But this was for my 20th to the 26th. <coughs> Had doctor's appointments. Uh, just different things that I kind of threw down in there. I'm back and forth to drugstores like crazy now because I pick up my husband's, I pick up mine, and I pick up my, my in-laws. So, like, I'm, I'm like the local little drug dealer, or at least the drug deliverer. That's what I am right now. And then this one, I didn't write down anything, and I need to. I really need, because I love this layout. It was just so pretty, and then I didn't use it. But it does go through. It starts today here. So it does take me through May. So I will definitely write down what I did the past few days because I was, I was actually busy. So I'm going to write down stuff here. And then that will start me in May. And then here is where you go in and you just, I, you can use this as a gratitude journal, your priorities for the month, jot it down. And this is very much also mis mishmashed, okay? This is uh, from the Dream Seeker. Um, happy planner <laughs> from the last time around I love this I just think the whole dream seeker thing was just beautiful the colors and the flowers it's just it's just beautiful so but this will be the last one that I use um, and see this is how dream seeker does daily so what I will do because this is for June I will go in and I will pull out some other some weekly tabs from one of my other planners and use that but this one see when does it start i don't think it starts to july yeah this one was out of my floral one so that's what i will be using for june and then july starts the squad goals so this goes from july to December of 2021 and I don't have it all in here yet because of course it's, it's not all going to fit I've got it through December of this year but isn't that beautiful just so beautiful and then what I do is I got the other half starting here I do uh, Bible journaling in this one so that's how I've got this one set up and I just think she's so beautiful. This one is so, so pretty. And again, I'm tempted to just flip because I love this so much. Just flip it on the other side. Love it so much. Okay. So that is what I used this past month and what I will probably continue to use some of. I do have a small one here too. This is a, a one that I just kind of, I don't really, I don't really do much with. I, I sometimes will take this with me. Um, when I go places, but you can see it's, it's very nicely decorated, but very sparsely used. <laughs> I mean, I love the way I've got it. The layouts, the layouts look really, really pretty. At first, when I got this kind of layout, I was like, I don't know what to do with it, but I figured it out and I like it. So, but anyway, that will go into May. And like I said, this one's very sparsely used. And I, my thing is when I get them and they're dated, I feel like I'm just wasting so much stuff. But always keep in mind, if you do, even if you do have dated ones, that's not, you know, you haven't used for whatever reason, you can always go in and, and you know, put in, get you a pack of the little numbers and redate it and use it for, you know, how you need it. But yeah, that one's cute. 
So that one's like I said, I will take it with me sometimes. Sometimes if I just want to do a notes, even though I have 50,000 set up just for notes. Oh, your girl's just losing her mind. Okay. And like I said, I do have, I've never used one of the Erin Condren Life Planners. Um, I do use these, the folios. I love these. These are fantastic. And I have one of the new, I have three of these right now. Um, and then I have one of the new ones that she just released coming in that's lavender, same color as this. And then some of the new inserts. But I also ordered, because I they had their 2020 um, live planners, which like I've said, I've never used one. Um, they had them 50% off, plus I got an insider code. So I, I got a, one of the 2020 big life planners for, for $10. And I got to cus customize my cover and everything. And then, of course, the covers are uh, interchangeable. So what I also did, I am going to use that when it gets here because I've never used one and I want to see how I like it. But um, I do have a couple of the ones from Michaels. But again, I never even popped them open to use them because they're undated so I can do whatever I want to with them. They're the faith ones. But I also ordered this off Macari. Because even though I love the cover that is that I've created for the Erin Condren one, um, they I got a floral one, and then you got to customize what color you want the background and everything. It's going to be really really pretty. I saw this on Macari, and I was like, oh my gosh, this is just too pretty. So I can interchange them, or I can actually use it as like bookmarks in the planner too. But isn't this stinking cute? I want one of these cups so, so bad. Just because they're too adorable. So many of the planner babes have them. Um, apparently they got them from Target. I've never seen one. And then when you see them, people have them selling them. They want like $1,000 for them because they're like, hey, collectors, planners, you know. And usually we are dumb enough to do that. But look, okay, so you get this. This is your cover. That's the inside of the cover. You get a little bookmark that you, you know, use as a dry erase. Ah, I love it so much. This is from Happy Scrappy. And it is stinking adorable. Your girl just, I can't resist the pretty. I just can't. I can't resist the pretty can't wait for there I think one of them is supposed to be here in my post office today I'm going to see if I can I don't feel like getting dressed today so I'm going to and see if I can get my husband when he wakes up he worked night shift to be a sweetie pie and run and grab him for me <laughs> plus I have some orders I need to mail out for my Macari too so I got stuff I got to do girls but this is gonna be a long video but I'm, a, I'm almost done so this is what I'm going to start using a little bit for my May show you guys what I did with some of it and you know how it is I I set it up and then I reset it up and you know how that goes so anyway so I've got these I got my little charm charms I made me some vellums let me pull this up so you can see it so this one says got a little rose on it and it says my name is Melissa and I'm a planner addict not sorry <laughs> So, hello, there's that with the rose that I made this, just as Planner Edit 2020, made that with pretty little roses, just decorated my little things up, so this will go into May, um, printed me out some inserts to use, it's hard to find inserts for an A6, this is an A6 size, and it is very difficult to find inserts that you can purchase for those, so... I had I got all my stuff off of Etsy and then some of it I, I made myself so here is my weekly the way it looks I've already flipped through this one time but I have got to go in and actually shade it up this is the first day of May so I've got it set up a little bit these of course because they're smaller you won't be able to you know decorate them quite as much but you can still make it cute. You can do it. And I'm just using all this as like little note spaces because I did not print them double sided. That's why they kind of look odd. I just print them like this. Just, you know, one page at a time. And very, very different layouts from week to week. 
And then this one. I used all of my Carpe Diem stickers on this one. And then this one I haven't done yet. So I made little dividers, put tabs on them for the months. And I've got it set up through August, I think. Yeah, August. And then I just have a lot of little cards in here, dividers I made, my monthly budget uh, thing I made. These are the little flip cards from Happy Planner. Uh, there's a daily schedule. Just another little pretty. Uh, and these are some extras I have for weeklies and things that I made and monthlies. Here's another one of my vellums that I made. Isn't that pretty? I love the way just the black and white looks on vellum. I think it's so just, I don't know, classy looking, if you want to say. Overview, a little divider I made. That will be some of my daily inserts. I also have some monthlies stuck in there that are monthlies on one page, which makes it really, really small. So I don't think I'll use those much. But I have my to-do section. And then I also have uh, cute little thingies there. A weekly. This came with it. So I have a weekly uh, overview here that I can use as well as the ones that I am uh, bought off Etsy. So, it's set up and ready to go for this month to use and, and make pretty. Oh, another vellum that I made. Just another rose. And she's ready to go. Cannot wait to get my other ones. The other one that I ordered, this one is the sandstone. I've told you guys this before. Sandstone with one of the pink colors on the inside. She has a few different ones. But I think this one is a, a dusty rose color. So the other one that I'm getting is... Um, it's a, a gray color, but it's gray in and out. What I did was, because they are pricey, this one was $78 used. Um, the one... If you wanted one of these brand new, I think they're $129. I think that's what it is, brand new, for the A6 size. I got a B6, I think is the size I ordered from them. And they have an oops sale department, which, and you get to pick basically how defected you want when you've got a five percent off 15 percent off and then a 30 percent off five percent off or minor defects uh 15 percent off or um you'll get like mismatched stitching or a or crooked stitching maybe one of the pockets is stitched in incorrectly uh, you know a little bit crooked and then 30 percent off you get some major defects um so what i did was i got one of those your choices are limited when you get these um, the one I got is going to be gray in and out, but a real pretty gray. And I love, love pretty grays. And I got it the one that was the 15% off. I didn't want to go with a 30% off because that's still kind of expensive for something's going to have major defects. But 5% wasn't that big of a discount, so I went with the 15. It seemed like the Goldilocks of the, of the three choices. So... When I get that, as soon as I get that, I will unbox that baby. And you know me, I'm going to let you guys see it all. Got to have someone to share my joy because my husband's not exactly into this. <laughs> For some reason, the bows don't appeal to him. I don't understand what's wrong with the man. Anyway. <laughs> all right. That's my month in flip through. I hope you ladies have a wonderful May. And let's pray this country gets back to you know some kind of normalcy there's actually been a little bit of good come out of of, of things people you know 